Hi guys, welcome back to this channel. Yes, controversial actor Uche Madu Agu has dragged Nollywood for neglecting Genevieve Nanchi. In May, that the actress has sparked concerns and worries when she shared a disturbing post on social media. Genevieve further created more worries in her fans as she deleted all her social media posts, deleted all her followers and wiped out her social media. There were speculations that Genevieve Inanji was battling a mental breakdown at an undisclosed hospital in Texas, United States. A US-based nurse, Syl Finesse, confirmed the rumors of Genevieve Inanji battling a mental breakdown at an American hospital in Texas. Meanwhile, contrary to report that Genevieve Inanji was battling a mental medical condition allegedly caused by drug abuse, German-based Nigerian blogger and journalist Stella Demoko Caucus debunked the claim and shed more light. Shedding light on the issues via a lengthy Instagram post, Stella confirmed that the actress was battling a medical condition that has been going on for quite some time now, but now involving drug abuse as viral reported. She pointed out that it was a medical condition that needed love and prayers. According to her, she had been in talk with some of Jennifer Pinanji's close friends for a long time, and they have been working hard to ensure the story of a medical condition did not get into the wrong hands. Nollywood actress Genevieve Inanji needs love and prayers to overcome what she's going through and not breaking news to allege that she's down because of drugs overuse. Oh my god, this is so wrong. I have been in the known of a medical condition that she's going through but decided to let it be until she was better. I have been discussing with some of our clothes from way back and we were wondering what would have happened if the info gets into the wrong ends and they decide to run with lies without investigating, Stella stated. Uche Madu Agu, who has been showing support for the single mom of one drag his colleagues for abandoning her, he praised Tonto DK for reportedly shaking up on her. This is so unfair. No popular Nollywood actress check up on Aunt Genevieve again. Only Mama King allegedly does. Mama King, thanks for always looking out for our legendary queen. Nollywood only spread bad news of colleague. Give them hear news story about Genevieve where no pleasant. Now, them go spread and pass radio. With different poetic words of encouragement, and Genevieve could definitely bounce back. She is an overcomer. Recall that Uche Madu Agu had believed why he would always stand by veteran actress Genevieve Inanji. Uche Madu Agu shared a photo of the actress and vowed he would always stand by her in good times and not so good times because. She is a priceless jewel of honor. He also declared that our weeping might endure for a night, but our joy will come in the morning. Guys, Genevieve Inanji, born 3rd May 1979, the Nigerian actress, producer, and director. She won the African Movie Academy Award for Best Actress in a Leading Role in 2005 making her the first actor to win the award. In 2011, she was honored as a member of the Order of the Federal Republic by the Nigerian government for her contributions to Nollywood. Her directorial debut movie, Lion Arts, is the first Netflix film from Nigeria and the first Nigerian submission for the Oscars. The movie was disqualified for having most of its dialogue in English. After having spent the case in the movie industry, she was profiled alongside some celebrities and business executives in 2020 
In two new books by publisher and editor, in chief of Yes International Magazine, Azo Arise. Genevieve was born in Imbase, Imo State, Nigeria, and grew up in Lagos. The fourth of eight children, she was raised in a middle class family. Her father worked as an engineer, and her mother was a nursery school teacher. She attended Methodist Girl College, Yaba, Lagos, before proceeding to the University of Lagos, where she graduated with a bachelor's degree in creative arts. While at the university, she began auditioning for acting jobs in Nollywood. Genevieve started her acting career as a child actor in the then popular television soap Opera Repos at the age of eight. In 1998, at the age of 19, she was introduced into the growing Nigerian film industry with the movie Most Wanted. Her subsequent movies include Last Party, Mark of the Beast, and EJ In 2010, she starred in the award-winning film EJ, The Journey. She has starred in over 200 Nollywood movies. In 2004, Genevieve Inanji signed a recording contract with EKB Records, a Ghanaian record label, and released her debut album, One Local Local Line. It is a mix of R&B, hip-hop, and urban music. In 2004, Genevieve Inanji was with the most votes after contending with other celebrities for the search of the face of Lux in 2004. In 2005, she won the African Movie Academy Award AMAA, for Best Actress in a Leading Role, becoming the first actor to win the award. As of 2009, Inanji was one of the best paid female actors in Nollywood. Due to her contribution to the Nigerian movie industry, she became the first actor to be awarded Best Actress at the 2001 City People Awards. The award ceremony that previously had only one recognized politician and business conglomerates. She was also the first actor to be awarded as Best Actress by the Censor Board of Nigeria in 2003. In 2009, she was referred to as a Julia Robert in African by Oprah Winfrey. In November 2015, Genevieve produced her first movie called Road to Yesterday, later winning Best Movie Overall West Africa at the 2016 African Magic Viewers' Choice Awards. In January 2018, it was reported that Geneva will be replacing Funke Akindele as a member of the Dora Milaje in Marvel's Avengers Infinity War. This was later debunked as an internet prank and the actor did not appear in the movie. On September 7, 2018, a directorial debunked land ad was acquired by online streaming service Netflix, making it the first Netflix original film from Nigeria. The movie had its world premiere at the 2018 Toronto International Film Festival, alongside farming the Adewale Akinoyo Agbaje's autobiographical directorial The Bonds, where she said, in alongside Kate Bankinsale, Damson Idris, and Guru Ra. On May 6, 2021, Genevieve Inanji was featured in a skit by Ofego titled Say It and Quench on his YouTube channel. Genevieve Inanji is also a women's activist. She advocates for Nigerian girls to be able to have a say in who they choose to marry. She is against early marriages for the girl child. She is strongly against the abuse of women in society. Genevieve says she is a strong advocate for social justice. Further, Genevieve Inanji is a strong feminist. She states a type of feminism in the woman who has the right to make her own choice and do whatever she feels like. Well guys, there you have it, actor Uche Madu Ago has dragged Nollywood for neglecting Genevieve Nanju. That's all about this video. 
and if you like the video, kindly give it a thumbs up for more content like this. Also, kindly subscribe, like, and drop your comment in the comment section. And click on the bell notification button to get updated on all our new videos. Thank you. Bye.